Hey there divas and gents, this is Magical Blackness here. I am here to tell you all about Tori and Sombre Lily Purple. Stay tuned for the review. Hey delightful divas and gents, this is Magical Blackness here to tell you all about this unit Tori. I'm on the fence about her. First time I purchased her after seeing reviews, I was like, ooh, I need her. I went ahead and got her and she swallowed my face up. <laughs> like she really was just everywhere. I looked like a purple lion. I did. I purchased this in the same color and I was like absolutely not. But then I decided to give this another chance after seeing reviews pop up on my little YouTube timeline. And I said let me try it again but let me reposition it, let me cut it, let me this, let me that. And I think um, we're doing a little better this time. I like it. What you think Divas? I'm not too sure where I would actually wear this to because it's a lot of hair and a lot of curls and a lot of purple. And um, I'm not sure about it. I had to uh, spray my um, dry shampoo on her to bring down the luster a little bit. It was a little bright, a little too bright for me. Um, I took pictures in her and I just wasn't sure if I liked her or not. I don't know what it is. But, um,. She's kind of looking okay, okay. Like, if I had an event tomorrow and I would need to reach for a unit, I don't know if I would grab this one first. Because um, I have other ones that I fell in love with right away. This one here, I'm okay about. I'm on the fence. But um, the luster was a lot. I had to spray the dry shampoo on her. She's from Sis Sister Wigs. I got her from Ebony Line. Of course, I don't know how much because I buy like hair and bulk these days. And I don't know how much they are. So many different hairs at one time. But um, I got it from Ebony Line. And uh, I think the more and more I look at her, the more I like her. I had to cut this right here to frame my face. She came long. She came like right down here. I don't know why they would do such a thing. <laughs> if you want this to go over the face, it's going to need to frame the face, right? So I had went ahead and cut it to frame the fix. And it's looking very fantastic right now. Um, but she's uh she's growing on me a little bit. Only had her on for a little while, so I would have to wear her out to an event to see how I like her. But first impression is mm, okay. I don't know. I don't know. It's not like it was last time. The last time I had her on. And I was like, oh, hell no, I ain't wearing this, especially not outside. So I went ahead and I had tossed her. I feel horrible, I know, right? I had tossed her and then I had came back to her and was like, you know what, let me try her again. Now, the parting space is nice. I did not have to open it up. She sheds just a little bit. She blends well. After cutting the lace off, I didn't get that much shedding, so that's great. That is great for a unit after you cut it not to get that much shedding. But um, she's looking good. She's looking good. I'm liking the curls. You got a finger comb her, girls. Do not, I repeat, do not put a brush in this, girls. Don't you do it. You end up with a frizzy hot mess. Don't do it. Do not disturb these curls with a brush. You will ruin it. You will. Um, please don't. Um, so I went ahead and I finger combed her through, you know, when it comes out the package, it has like the stringy little spirally curls. So pretty much like this, but you want some of them to stay to have the curl definition. You don't want to mess them all up and, uh, have a frizzy hot mess. That's not what you want to do. But I'm liking the, uh, 1B root here leading on over to the nice color. This is a great unit all in all.